We're on our way to what they call Bordo in St. Thomas. From here, they're from here. I'm not from here. I'm from Jamaica. Okay, okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, this is called Perseverance Bay, right here. And then that's Island Saba. This island over here with the, the hilly one? Yep. That's Saba. Saba. And I um, can't remember the name of the rocks. You see the little triangle sticking up out of the water? The yep. Water? That's called Sail Rock. Sail Rock, wow. And you see behind there's an island? Mm -hmm. yeah, that's Vieques. Vieques. Oh, that's off of Puerto Rico. Right. And if you look, you can't quite see it, but the next one you would see is Culebra and then Puerto uh, Rico on the far side of it, but you don't see it. Yeah. Vieques. Wow. Have you ever been? Yeah. yeah. Do you work for the tourism board? No. Oh, you just I'm, know the information. I'm, well, I'm on here. Oh, okay. <laughs> I grew up at that airport and I was born at that airport. Tell me about that. That was cool. Uh, you guys know where Nisky Church is? Uh, not me. Hiking, guys, and you coming with us? We're in Bordeaux, in St. Thomas, Botany Bay, to be specific. And um, yeah, we're excited. So, if you're looking for Mermaid's Chair, you will go to the preserve at Botany Bay. They will not let you park on the premises, so you have to park on the street. When you're here at Botany Bay, you have to check in. <laughs> Um, come, name come. and photo. So the, we can take the shot and come back up. And before the rain don't come again. And before the rain. All right, guys. So we're about to go down the hill. We got the map. We're about to go on the right track. As Jai said, you're tracking. We are tracking. We're about to go. Check out these views. We're five minutes, we're two minutes in, Did and they're balling already. She on the phone. She was like, Hi. Two minutes in. <laughs> two minutes in, I watched them. You guys. And I got, how can I walk out gay? <laughs> how can I walk out gay? I didn't expect it. Look at them. To be work. They I come got... for views. I want content, you gotta walk for it. This is a gym warm up for me. Yo, yo. The race is for the swift. Once again, you all see me on another hike. This time I decided to lead the trail. I'm pulling up the rear with them this time. See? Now pulling up the rear with them. So you got us up here. Females in the back. Car coming, car coming. Yeah, uh, car from the front, vehicle from the front. Uh, uh, stop touch. 
You all hear the, the light? The electricity? Yeah. All right, guys, so when you get not to the bottom of the hill, but probably halfway down, you're going to hit a little fork. Not a fully fork, it's a little Y. Botany Bay way this way, and you got Treadneedle Bay this way at the fork. Look. Beaches, because we come up here and we go around. We, this is where we kind of made the turn. That's what it is. That's what it is. So you this way? All right, so guys, so like I was saying, when you get to the halfway down the hill and you get to the Y, you go to the left. Oh, this is the Y. You go straight. It's going to take you down to the beach, and if you go to the left, yeah, treadmill way, it's going to take you to Mermaid's Chair, all right? So come on, let's go. Check out Mermaid's Chair. You hear me, babe? How oh, so would you say? Which, which direction? North, south, east, or west? Oh. Uh, which one was it? I don't know. Oh, he didn't figure it out? Thank you. I'm okay. gonna hit a little fork, not a fully fork. It's a little Y. So you continue to the right side and you go straight down. All right, we made it. Babe is about to take off the drone. We made it guys to Mermaid's Chair, well almost. You can see it right ahead over there. I'll try to get a picture and insert that so you guys can see it a little bit better. So I believe Mermaid's Chair is a section where the islands connect to each other. Kind of like a peninsula. Not a peninsula. Is that rain? Mm -hmm. Where's that? Oh. We made it to Mermaid's Chair, guys. We're, um, based on what we've figured out, the slopes is considered the Mermaid's Chair because said that maybe that's where mermaids would go and kind of like sit because it's sloped from the water all the way up. But I will tell you this, it's very peaceful and had it not been a rainy day, I would have chilled out here. For sure.
So due to the rain coming down, we weren't able to capture the ending of the hike, but uh, it was a great experience. One that you definitely need to be prepared for. It was super hard, but we had a good time. Um, next time we head back there, we hope to spend a longer period of time exploring Mermaid's Chair. But if you have any questions at all, leave them down in the comment section. Thank you guys so much for watching, for subscribing, and just for being here. See you next time. Yeah.